Hello everyone and welcome to the One Man Renegade Productions YouTube channel. I'm your host, Leon Burgig B, and today we are doing another stack of packs from this 2004 Top Series 1 MLB Baseball Hobby Box. If you missed part one, head up there, check it out. While you're at it, head on down, hit that subscribe button, hit the notification bell, hit the thumbs up, like the video, hit that share button, share this with everyone in the world. Head over in the comments and, you know, you don't have to tell me how much of an idiot I am because I know. Uh, I realized in the last video, and I'll, I'll talk about it in a second, but or I'll show you. There was a card that I pulled that was an insert, and I looked in the back, and I was like, wait, why does this look like a regular card in the back? There, there was a card stuck to it, and I wasn't paying any attention, um, but we'll talk about it in a minute. Uh, but also, check out the, the link. Well, actually, in the comments, you don't have to tell me. I mean, just say hi. And then uh, check out the links in the description for my blog, podcast, other social media, as well as my eBay, where a bunch of cool stuff up for sale, so go check that out and buy some stuff if you want to. Um, all right, we're doing another stack of packs. Yeah, so this um, Barry Zito Hobby Masters, I was like, wait, and I turned it over and there was another card stuck to it, which had like red, regular, like a regular back. So I'm like, what is this? And yeah, it was a completely different player, completely different card. I wasn't paying attention. And then it happened two seconds later with the Jeter and I noticed it. So I should have went back and been like, hey, wait a minute. There's a card stuck to this. Uh, yeah, for some reason, cards stick into the inserts. No other sticking, um, though, so that's good. And yes, if you missed it, we did get the out of your um, rookie card last time. A little bit of printing issues on it, unfortunately, but um, hopefully we can get a gold, maybe, or a black, or something. Some sort of parallel of that. That'd be really cool. But um, yeah, other than that, there's really not much we're looking for in terms of the regular set. I mean, just stars and Hall of Famers, I suppose. But in terms of rookies, there's not much else. Vring Wells, Kip Wells. Wow, that's weird. Back-to-back -back Wells. Went to the well one too often, huh? Yeah, 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 yeah sorry. Uh, Tim Spoonie Barger. <laughs> Orlando Hudson. David Murphy. Uh, got Pedro, Esteban Loiza, and Roy Halladay. A couple of Hall of Famers. And then Esteban Loiza. Strikeout leaders. Um, Rocky Biddle. Chris Hammond. Steve Sparks, Russell Branion, and a couple of the student work get top of the clock. I don't know, a couple of those for some reason. Um, all right. David Eckstein. We got Geronimo Gill, Carl Pavano, Chris Benson, Alex Gonzalez, uh, postseason highlights, Derek Lowe, and... Ivan Rodriguez, uh, Kevin Millar, who, this is a weird card, um, not because it's off center, but Kevin Millar is a weird situation because he was, um, a replacement player in 1995. So because of that, since he crossed the picket line and all that, he wasn't in the major league baseball, although they still have the stamp. That's weird. He wasn't technically, he couldn't be in the PA, which I don't think they should have that right there. Um, so he wouldn't be, it wasn't in like the video games. He wasn't in like other sets, but since Tops did their, like the way they did it, I don't know if they still do it this way, but the way they used to do like um, their contracts with the players, they didn't go through the MLP PA specifically. And they would go, go to, that's the way they would get around having guys like Kevin Millar in the product. They would just sign him. Same with Barry Bonds, Barry Bonds, same way he dropped out of the union um, or plays association, and then he kind of did his own thing. So, like, Tops had to sign him to, like, an actual deal to get his cards and stuff. Uh, Michael Barnett, uh, Lloyd McLennan, Carlos Tosca. Uh, yeah, so that's, yeah, little interesting factoid there about Kevin Millar. If you ever wondered why back in the day he was never in the video games, it's because he was a replacement player. Uh, Preston Wilson... We got Noma, throwing Nomar and down, why not? Uh, Manny, it's back-to-back -back Red Sox. Of course, Nomar wouldn't finish the season with the Red Sox. Um, Larry Boa, Kevin Minch, ERA leaders, another Pedro. Throw him up there. Danny Graves, Inar Diaz, Kyle Loesch, uh, Aubrey Huff, and a checklist. All right, next pack. Got Alex Rodriguez, of course, when he was still at the Rangers before he moved over to the Yankees. Almost a Red Sox. Almost a Red Sox. Very close. They 
couldn't quite come to the deal and the players association got in because like he was willing to take a pay cut and the players association said no i can't do that and then it fell apart and then the yankees and then brett boone not sorry brett boone aaron boone got hurt and then the yankees just jumped in brett tomko mark grudzianic uh, milton bradley uh bill miller sporting news card we got World Series highlight Reggie Jackson blast series record three home runs in game six. That's actually a cool looking card. I mean, I don't want to talk about the Red, the Yankees winning the World Series or anything like that, but it is a cool looking card. Um, Bobby Jenks and Casey Kochman, future star cards. Uh, Jim Tracy, Lou Pinella, and Sean Chasson. 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 Sean, I know. I, I, I don't know why I can't say his name. Sean Chacon. Is that how you say it? I don't know. It's been a long time since I thought about Sean Chacon. Or Chacon. Yeah. Scott Strickland. Strickland. Uh, Mike Remlinger. Mark Mulder. Eric Wedge. Uh, Masterful Millwood. No one. No hits. Giants. I can read. Uh, 100th anniversary of... Oh, so they're saying it was the 100th anniversary of the Fall Classic. I get it now. Um, sorry, a little bit of an interruption right there. But All right. Uh, we got this card here. Cleveland Indians and Brooklyn Dodgers from the 1920s World Series. Um, 1920 World Series. Uh, Miguel Olivo, Brandon Donnelly, Bobby Higginson, Esteban Loiza. And another one of those students' cards. All right, next pack. We got Matt Manti, Jared Washburn, Albert Pujols, Raphael Furcal, Jake Peavy, 2003 American League hits leaders, including Ichiro, Billy Wagner, Mark uh, Matt Creighton, uh, Hideo Nomo, and Donald Levinsky. All right, a few more packs to go for this week, and then we'll do another stack next week, and then final stack the week after. All right, we got um, Richie Sexton, Ray Durham, Travis uh, Driscoll, Juan Pierre, Ben Davis, uh, postseason highlights, uh, Bob Friendly, Ichiro, there is Ichiro, uh, Jimmy Haynes, CC Sabathia and a checklist card. All right, we got uh, Aaron Rowan, oh, Rowan uh, Dave Berg, Alex Cora. Of course, you now the Red Sox was the Red Sox manager, then got fired, then got rehired. Um, Tim Wakefield, Damian Miller. Uh, Alex Rodriguez sporting news card. Future star cards, uh, Khalil Green and Bernie Castro. Christian Guzman, uh, Omar Falcon, uh, Josh Beckett, and another one of those, whatever those are. And we're down to the final pack for today. Um, thank you everyone for watching. Again, come back next week for another stack. We got Flash Gordon. See, I always, I've talked about this before, I feel like, but I always, like, it's always weird to me, like, when they decide to, like, put their nickname instead of their actual name. Tops did that from time to time, but, like, they'd go back and forth, I feel like. Like, it wasn't consistent. Uh, Flash Gordon, of course, Tom Gordon. Uh, Romero Mendoza, we got a gold card coming up. Uh, Julio, Jorge Julio, Marcus McBeth. We got Marlon Shark, the Ward Pulse season highlights, and our our uh, gold card is Deonor Navarro. Funny story about Deonor Navarro. Um, one time, me and my sister were at a game. It was when he was playing with the Rays. Um, the year the Rays actually went to the World Series. Uh, Brad Wilkerson, uh, Hank Blaylock, Pedro Estacio, and Ken Maka rounding things out there. But uh, we were at the Red Sox, uh, uh, Tampa Bay, and it was going one's extra innings and. My sister was like, oh, I can't stay. I got to leave. So, like, she made me leave the game. And I'm like, all right, the Red Sox lose this game. And they did. And then the 
Rays go on to win the World Series, which they didn't, but if they had, the deal was that my sister had to name her kid Dionor. Um, but luckily for Drew, my nephew, uh, the Rays lost the World Series. So I'm sorry, Rays fans, you lost the World Series to the Phillies because of that. Uh, I'm, I'm going to say that. Uh, but <laughs> that's going to do it for today. It's a little... Little little story for you. Um, that's gonna do it for today. I'll come back next week. We'll do another stack of packs from this uh, box. Uh, but come back every day. I got videos posted every day. Sometimes two in a day. Like later on today, there should be a tops.com Tuesday video. So come back for that. But the best way to know when the videos are ready to watch is to hit that subscribe button, hit the notification bell, and then you can uh, get the notification. Come back and uh, watch the videos, like the videos, share the videos, comment on the videos and all that fun sort of thing. And that's the key word there, fun, is that's what we're having here on the on this channel. It's all about fun. So thank you everyone for watching. Stay safe, have fun, and we'll talk to you next time. Bye.